This is the first song we started to write uh, for the album, but it took us uh, almost the entire writing process to finish it. Initially we had two different songs in the works, but uh, we felt they would have uh, worked better if combined together. It features a monologue of our acoustic guitars and uh, we decided to do it in Italian because uh, it's our native language and we wanted it to be very expressive and dramatic. The chorus of Shining Perpetuity is very big, slow and melodic, enriched by clean vocals and some string arrangements. Everything is shrouded in a black metal halo, giving it a dark and a ethereal atmosphere. The first riff of this song is ten times more complicated of what it seems. I mean, when Andrea sent me the first version of this riff, I worked on it and I made it super difficult and articulated by adding a lot of details without really changing the main theme. It's my thing to make everything more interesting to play and almost impossible for everyone to replicate. It took me a long time to conceive and finalize the solos of this song. I remember one night when we were recording demos for the album, I heard Andrea working on that second solo and I could only hear the guitar because he was working with his headphones on. And I remember thinking, what the hell is he doing? He's obviously out of key. And then uh, he let me listen to the whole thing with his headphones. And uh, I was blown away because it sounded so beautiful. And I would have never thought or suggested something like that for this solo. And this is what I like the most about Andrea's writing style. He always brings out something unexpected. The bass arrangements of this song is one of my favorites. Especially the chorus, because the bass and all the other instruments uh, complement each other so well. There's a lot going on during the verses as well. They are full of different enrichments and uh, variations. The stain on my soul remains! 